After lunch, the riders were competing in trail and western riding. What is the goal of the Youth World Cup? Well, the goal is threefold. Number one is to bring kids from all over the world together for sportsmanship. Another is to provide leadership skills as they learn to work with each other in, in new horses in a new situation. And the third would be competition. But uh, more importantly probably is the friendships that will be made this week from uh, young people from 15 different countries all over the world. Those will be lifetime memories that uh, they'll take with them from here and they'll have a new set of friends forever. Did you like the horsemanship? All the classes so far have been really, really good. Uh, the, the top riders have been matched with some good horses and have been able to showcase their riding skills. But, uh, you know, more importantly, I think, is just everybody cheering for one another, the applause when each horse and rider exit the arena. That's what the World Cup's all about. What was the most difficult part for you? Uh, I think it was uh, the lobo uh, was, was, yeah, last, year, last time I was riding him, he was a bit, yeah, running over them. But he was really nice, he didn't step on them, so I was just, yeah, really proud of him. <laughs> Would you like to say something to European organizers? Well, the Federation of European uh, Quarter Horse Associations have done a magnificent job of uh, making this event happen. My thanks go to Paul and his team for, for all their hard work, and it's paid off with a very smooth run show. Uh, everyone seems to be very happy, and uh, there's a spirit of cooperation among the European countries that uh, is, uh, is great. How do you feel? Yeah, I don't know. I can't believe it. It's yeah. Can't say something to that. Do you like some disciplines more than Western riding? I think no, not. But yeah, I really like trail and pleasure. But I think now Western riding is one of my favorite disciplines.